Well, a Cherry Hill, New Jersey father has filed a federal lawsuit over a school policy that allows students to choose which pronouns they prefer to use in the classroom. Action News reporter Toronto Thomas joins us live in the Satellite Center tonight with that story. And Toronto, this is an issue we're seeing play out in other school districts as well. Yes, with different results depending on the school district. The father says this is about protecting the rights of parents, but LGBTQ plus advocates say it's about protecting the rights and identities of students. Opinions on an issue with which some school districts are grappling, kids choosing their pronouns. I think that once you get to a certain age, like maybe middle school and high school, I think that you're old enough to know what you want. Yeah, the parent has rights. I mean, they have the legal right over the child until 18. Cherry Hill School District's policy allows students to determine what pronouns they want to use, like he, she, or they, without having to notify their parents. Upset over the policy, Rick Short, who has three children in the district, has filed a federal lawsuit. It seeks to change the policy so that parents would be notified if a student changes their pronouns. I think I should know everything my child is doing in school. I mean, why, why does the school have to hide things? Short's attorney says the policy violates parents' rights. The parents are being removed from the conversation about their children's gender identity being changed. But organizations like Garden State Equality support the pronoun policy, which they say was established statewide when trans students' guidance passed in 2017. There's only a handful of districts that have moved to reverse these policies, and I can't really understand why anyone would remove policies that are keeping kids safe. Different districts leaning different ways on the issue. The school district of Philadelphia allows students to change their pronouns without a parent's permission. But in Central Bucks, parents must be notified if a student wants to change their pronouns. It's part of a wider movement to roll back LGBTQ progress in this country. I think I should have more parental rights over a guidance counselor. A hot button issue now the focus of a federal lawsuit. We did reach out to the Cherry Hill School District. They declined to comment, citing the pending litigation. And the Satellite Center, Toronto Thomas, Channel 6 Action News.